Dundalk woman is facing attempted murder charges after she allegedly shot and wounded her husband and seven-year-old son. ABC 2's Mallory Safaste has more on the altercation that police say prompted the woman to pull out a gun and fire. Mallory. Jamie, the mother is Erica Shiflett. Police say she was trying to leave the house with her son, but her husband went to stop her. He was carrying the boy back to the house. Then Shiflett fired one shot, hitting the two of them. Larry Weber was turning on to his street Saturday night sometime around 7 when he spotted a commotion across from his house. So I went over to the porch where the, uh, the Kenny and, her, and his son were shot to see if I could help him out any. But they already had a tourniquet on his arm. He got shot through the wrist. The father did. And then the boy, little boy, got shot through the wrist and the side. Police believe the shooter to be Erica Shiflett, the boy's mother, and Russell Kenneth Shiflett's wife. This is a horrific incident. Uh, the man, they were arguing over the son. She wanted to take him. He didn't want her to take him. And instead of working it out between them, she pulled out a gun and started shooting. According to court documents, several family members were at the house and tackled Shiflet to the ground after she fired one shot. After they saw this, they grabbed her, took her to the ground, and held her until police arrived. Witnesses say the couple were having marital issues. From my understanding, she. She's, he made her to go down to her dad's house. Um, I guess uh, they weren't getting along. So she went to come up and take her kid, and full custody of the kid. And he said no. So he was keeping the kids at the house. Shiflet told police she didn't intend to shoot anyone. She's since been charged with attempted first degree murder and two counts of first and second degree assault. Nothing like that ever happens in this neighborhood, you know? And uh, to see something like that take place, yeah, it's disheartening. Yeah. The husband was treated and released from Johns Hopkins Medical Center. The boy remains hospitalized, but according to the staff there, he's in good condition. And Shiflet is currently in the hospital for an undisclosed reason. Police say it's not because of anything that happened at the scene, and she's being guarded by Baltimore County Police. All right, Mallory Safaste on that story tonight.